Hey guys, we got a special one for you today from Barbecue Joe's Kitchen. We are going to be making a surf and turf hamburger roll. You're gonna love it. Subscribe guys, we got a lot more videos that we wanna share with you. We're always making new videos. Plus, we got a pile load of uh, videos in our library. So subscribe, take a look at them. Guys, you're gonna love them. So like, share, and subscribe. All right, so we're gonna get this going right away. See you guys in a bit. start off with uh, two pounds of hamburger meat. Uh, we're going to be putting one cup of panko crumbs in there, two teaspoons of salt, one teaspoon of black pepper, two teaspoons of garlic powder, two eggs, And we're going to be mixing this up. All right, guys, we got all kinds of goodies here. We have shrimps. We have cheese, sharp cheddar cheese. We have crab flakes. We have uh, spinach. We have a uh, dill mayonnaise uh, dressing that I will put the uh, recipe in the description. We have some bacon. And of course, we have our amber meat with all the spices we mixed in a while ago. So, let's get this going. We're gonna lay out this, the uh, bacon slices first. Guys, you will want to stretch out your bacon just a little bit. So then we're going to put our hamburg meat over top. Kind of lay it flat. Just lay, don't put it right to the edge because we kind of need this uh, bacon to uh, to go over the other part of the bacon. We're not going to go right to the edges on both ends. So we're going to spread around our uh, dill mayonnaise. It's going to add a little uh, flavor to the whole thing and keep it really moist. Then we're going to uh, put our, our, actually we're going to put our spinach leaves first. Just kind of spread them around. Then we're going to put our uh, cheddar cheese. Some uh, shrimps. And that's where the surf comes in. With tons of goodness. And finally our crab flakes. Now comes the tricky part. Let's try to roll this up. All right, I'm gonna go grab some foil. See the foil's gonna do, it's gonna help it hold it together until it, it cooks and then it's gonna hold by itself. And we'll take the foil at the end, near the end, and we're gonna, we're gonna be uh, cooking this uh, directly uh, on the grill so that uh, the bacon cooks really well. So. Okay. 
All right, here we have our hamburger roll. We're gonna be going out on the trigger and we're gonna be cooking this at 350. And the last 25 minutes, we're gonna take the, the foil off so the bacon can cook. Okay guys, our trigger is set at 350. We're gonna be putting our roll in and we're gonna keep it in there for 25 minutes and then we're gonna take the foil off and attempt to take it out of the, uh, the pan and put it directly on the grill. So let's get that going. All right, guys, look at this masterpiece. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay, so I guess like always it's time to taste it. I'm gonna cut right down the center here. I'm gonna cut a thin slice over here. We'll open that up. Oh my god, look at that, oh, it's full of flavor, put a piece in here, all right, let's give this a try. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Surf and turf at its best. Wow. This is awesome, guys. This is an awesome recipe. You gotta give it a try. If you like what you see, please subscribe to our channel. You just press that subscribe button right below the video here. And you won't regret it. By the way, now that is barbecue, baby. Ciao.